Hello, Identity 5 Gamers! You know, I realized, uh, especially since with Koa, I haven't really done any, um, guessing your rank videos in, like, a very, very, very long time, like, almost two months. So today, we're gonna do some guessing your rank. It's only gonna be a short video. This is a mini edition. We're only gonna do, like, three-ish matches of guessing your rank. But, you know, I wanted to, uh, you know, get back into it, especially since I haven't done it in a while. After Koa, we'll probably have a ton of guessing your rank videos since I still have a lot of, uh, submissions to go through. But today, we'll have, like, a little mini one to put a dent in the, uh, Submissions. It's also very weird seeing two Fredericks, but you know what? I, I'm not complaining. He's a pretty cool guy. Anyways, let's just get into the matches. Alrighty, on to the first match. We are going to be... Oh! Sophia Melly! Yo, that's awesome. That is awesome. That is awesome. Okay, okay. That's that's hype. I'm already, I'm already interested. I'm already interested. Oh my gosh, I'm already interested. Okay, it's going to be uh, Coordinator watching. Silly Ben here, the Coordinator. We've got Entomologist, uh, Lawyer, and Doctor on the team, and they're going up against a smiley face. Uh, I think the recording is a little zoomed in, so we can't like see the full build. But it looks like Smiley is actually not running insulin, so it looks like he has trump card detention, and I can only imagine he has blink. Um, so it looks like- oh my- oh my! Okay? You ran into him? I- okay. I know what the idea was that you were probably scared. You were probably scared, but if you hear it's a smi- It's a patroller Smiley. It's a- it's a- it's a patroller Smiley. It's, it's a patroller smiley. And he can't even hit his patroller! He can't even! Yeah, I mean, you're doing what you're supposed to do. When it, when, it, when a patroller comes at you, if you, like, can run in a circle, sometimes you don't get hit by it, and, yeah, because the thing is, patroller moves really fast, so it's kind of hard to, um, hit it, but, like, patroller smiley. That's a meme. I'm pretty sure that's literally just straight up a meme. Also, playing smiley face into, on Arms Factory, with an entomologist on the team, is crazy. I can't even lie. That's actually crazy. Plus, chasing a coordinator first, you can just shoot gun, and then boom. He can't do anything. He literally can't do anything. So why would you use patroller? And you have no instance. What is this? I'm so confused. I'm actually so confused. So, the, yeah, the kiting out of the patroller was good. Well, not kiting out, you know. You know, not getting hit by it, I guess. Kiting out is a whole other, you know, situation with patroller. But how on... What, what is this smiley doing? Why did he bring patroller and not insolence? And also playing him on Arms Factory into an entomologist and coordinator for that matter. Dude, he's cooked. Like, he's asking to lose. He's actually asking to lose. I am so confused. That That is that is definitely, like, the hunter choice of all time. He does have dash up, but you have pallet. And is he going to try and mind game it? Oh, he doesn't know how to. Okay, he's moving really slowly. Is he a bad ping or something? That looks really slow. That looks really slow. Um... I don't know, but that looks way slower than normal. He did not even try to mind game that at all. He did not try to mind game it in the slightest, so... And there's Ento Bees, hold on, Melly Bees? With the do accessory? Sorry, my, my voice is going through it, bro. <laughs> that's, what, that's what happens when you stream for like eight hours every single day, um, and also record videos, and also do other things. He's gonna use Patroller again. Oh my gosh, he's gonna use Patroller again. I don't know why you're cutting out into like the dead area, but I guess it's to avoid the Patroller. Please tell me he hits this. Okay, he does finally hit it. Jeez. All right, let's see. Let's see. Where are you going to move after this patroller, though? You're kind of just out in the open. Still out in the open. St st still out in the open. Not going to try to... I mean, I guess you're trying to get away from him. But um, he pretty much gets this hit here. Yeah, he gets this hit here. Okay, so the best thing to do there was try to maybe try and vault with the patroller. I'm not completely sure of the timings, but you can you can vault to cancel patroller bites. You can drop pallets to cancel patroller bites. It could have been at least something to try to do, except uh, besides staying out in the open area. I know he was coming from that direction, but I'm not sure. Maybe he just wanted to die, away, die, die far away in the corner. I, I can see that as well, especially since your kite was long enough. I'm just very confused about this smiley. Like, you, you've been doing just fine. Sophia, why would he... Huh? How did that hit? Did she get off her bees? I couldn't tell. And now she's body blocking you? Okay, you love to see the support from Melly. And the cyber machine is primed. It's already primed. Okay, well, um, this smiley has got three hits in the entire game, and the cypher's already primed. Yeah, see, this is why we don't play smiley without insults on Arms Factory with Patroller into an Entomologist. And Coordinator, for that matter, but Ento, like, hard counters smiley. And also, wait, why are we bringing him to the cypher? Are there two cyphers that are primed? Um, Terra Shock, pop. There we go, okay. Um... I guess there were two ciphers that were primed. So yeah, nobody nobody got posted up on a gate. So it looked like two people were at the cipher, but nobody nobody posted up on a gate. And we're not heading to the pallets for some reason. Okay, there were pallets literally right there. I'm not sure why we didn't go there. Uh, Corner is like, leave me, leave me, 
you behind. Okay, that should be... He could draw this, actually. He could draw... He's gonna drop the patroller. Just walk over there. Just walk over there. Better yet, dash over there, and then miss your dash, and then hit with the tension. Then you can get a draw. Okay. Doc. She vaults. Okay, he finally mind gamed it. This you're telling me that's a draw? How is that a draw? And why are they gate waiting? How is that a draw? And why did he bring? I don't understand. I I, I I'm so confused. This was definitely one of the weirdest. Come on, guys, leave, leave, guys, leave. Why are they waiting outside of the gate? If he had TP, he'd TP and kill you immediately. Unless. Melly? No, just leave. What are we doing? What rank are we in? I know the whole point is supposed to be guessing your rank. I, I can only guess, like, this this has to be Hound. This has to be Hound. This has to be Hound. It has to be. The, I, I, I can't see it as any other else. That smiley was just so weird. This has to be Hound. And you are in Elk 1. That's surprising. That means you're almost Mammoth? And we're playing Smiley like that? That's... Dude, Elk Elk truly is crazy. You can either have like godlike players or like very, very questionable players. Okay, so apparently, according to the title of this, as you can see, this is a season 25 rank match. So um, typically I like getting rank matches from the season that we were uh, looking at. I think since this was a while ago, this is all of... Uh, you know, the previous season, we're not actually sure. But most of these submissions were like from two months, or a month and a half ago actually, I think not, not quite two months ago, almost two months ago. Um, but yeah, uh, this is gonna be a little weird because this is season 25, so there are some characters that don't even exist yet. So like, so like Cheerleader, I guess, wouldn't exist yet. Wait, was Opera even around in season 25? So yeah, there would be no Opera here. I don't think, I don't think Opera was, uh, was Opera 26? I actually don't know. Anyway, I'm um, chasing Toy Merchant first. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. Uh, you do have Confined Space. Your build is Confined Space. That's Fast Pallet Break, so you're going to have Teleport. Don't have Blink? Are you, are you, unless that's just Fast Pallet Break without... No, you have Confined. So it's Confined, Detention, Teleport? No, you have Blink. Never mind. Okay, I guess your Teleport is your bird. Never mind. All right. Oh, wait. I think it said Basement. It said Basement in here. So yeah, they're going to just shove everybody in Basement. Oh, I can't even lie, this actually is a really weak team. Doctor, Mechanic, Enchantress. Toy Merchant is fine, but the other three, all, all the other three characters here are pretty not great characters. Doctor, very bad. Mechanic, very hit or miss. Um, and Enchantress, obviously, is annoying, but not necessarily good. Mechanic is going to try and wait this out, but if you get the drop down hit properly, you're good to go. Let's see. This is good patience. This is good patience. I'm just going to hit her here. Oh, she got stuck on your body. She got stuck. Blink down, blink down in. Yup, 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 yup. I saw that coming. I saw that coming. Yup. I saw that coming. Yup, yup, yup. I saw that coming from a mile away. And you know, if, and you know, Doc, you know, you have a bird on Doc. So, Enchantress right here, can you get a drop down? You do get a drop down. Okay, she stuns you, but can you hit her in time? You've got full prez. Yep, you can indeed hit her. She actually tried to bait a chair hit there, which was smart. But um, Nightmare just kind of goes around that. And you know where the dock is. You know where she is. And she's coming in. Oh my gosh, you know where she is. That's so funny. You know where she is. Oh my gosh. Or wait, that is the dock, right? Yeah, that's the dock. Doc, he can he can see you. He saw your bird. He, he knows you're there. Okay, get the pallets done. She vaults uh, in. She vaults away. And goodbye. Okay, so I um I can only guess Cobra. You you did just fine, but like these survivors did absolutely nothing. I, I hate to say it, but they did absolutely nothing. The only thing that was good was the Enchantress trying to bait the chair hit, but everything else like they just kind of got swept. Uh, <laughs> and the emo too. Okay, okay. Dang, dude, basement party. Okay, I've got to guess Cobra. I'm sorry. You cooked, but the survivors didn't, so it's it's hard to guess when that that kind of thing happens. And you are in Manticore three at the time of this gameplay. How? How are those Griffin players? Those are supposed to be Griffin players? Are you serious? Like, don't get me wrong. Your nightmare was your nightmare was good. You cooked. You cooked. I'm not saying you did bad, but those survivors? How are those Griffins? How? If, if somebody's in Basin, why didn't you just sell? Why did they all go down? 
Uh, that was definitely a match for the survivors. Good, uh, good stuff though. Alrighty, on to the next match. We are going to be watching Selena Florence, also known as Nini. Um, they are going to be playing journalist here, rocking the new uh, Koa skin here. Uh, not necessarily new, but new, newer, newer. The new uh, Koa B tier skin for journalist, and they're going up against a Bloody Queen. Now, I actually really love journalist versus Bloody Queen because you can actually, um, you can you can make her hit the doofies, the little the little illusions. Um, I, I just call him Doofy, Doofius uh, on this channel. But if you're new, I, it's, it's called the Illusions, um, the, the Containment Illusion. You can make you can make her hit the Containment Illusions without too much trouble. I, I really like Journalist versus Mary, honestly. I, I really like Journalist versus Mary because um, I'm actually pretty bad against Mary. But having having a Journalist versus Mary when I play Journalist, it feels pretty good because I can actually I feel like I can actually do something. So it's basically like three. I guess now at this point with Journalist's new buff, I don't think Journalist's buff is in this uh, specific video, but um, but Journalist's new buff this this would be. Uh, four containment loot. So you'll be able to block it four times if you're taking the kite. Uh, there is a puppeteer in the match too with Tide. Uh, that's not really ideal. Puppeteer, despite being a rescuer based character, is actually really not that good at rescuing. Mary tried a blink drop down hit but did not get it. That's interesting. But yeah, pu Puppeteer with Tide is not very good because the thing is you're pretty, you're pretty much asking yourself to get double down. And with Puppeteer not being able to heal that well, yeah, it's, it's pretty rough. It's pretty rough. I, I do think Puppeteer can cook in some niche situations, but um... Yeah, it's just he's just he just needs a little he just needs some buffs, dude. He needs some buffs. Honestly, dang, that was an accurate mirror. I mean, she does have wanted, but even then, that was like right on point. That was actually like right on top of you. All right, let's see. Are we gonna go containment? That's containment. Good, 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 good. Very good, very good, very, very good. Allowing yourself to get to the chair a lot faster. And you know, blink has been used, so you can wait it out, wait it out. You get the chair hit too. Okay, hold on. You're cooking. You're cooking. You're cooking. Um, you don't need a body you don't need a body block. Okay, you should not be body blocking here. You should not be body blocking. No. You should not body block if the person has tied, because all you're doing is taking damage. And this is way too much support. This is way too much support. No 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 no. Yeah, you should not be body blocking for somebody if you have tied. Because all you're doing is making it so it's difficult for you to get the rescue next time. Um, and most of the time, 20 seconds, depending on where there's somebody is chaired. Uh, with tide turn, the whole point is to transition to a different area and be chaired in the better area, right? So a good example is Gardner was at Corner House, right? She died at Corner House. So the, the, the pallets at Corner House were probably used. So she wants to use Tide Turner to die and transition toward a better area where she can actually kite. Um, but yeah, she does She does actually cut it out. And if they can get out, that's that's also fine. But you should never really body block um, after first. If you rescue before half and they have Tide, do not body block. That is not what you should do. The only time to do that is like if your full team is agreeing on it. But in a regular ranked match, you should not body block because then Journalist would be damaged here and she would not be able to go for the rescue without using her little Doofy clone, which is usually better to, um, you know, save with detention or basement or if you're injured and like nobody else can do it. So yeah, it looks like Puppeteer is going to take the rescue here. Does get hit without using Lewis. Uh, but now the thing is, if she just hits Puppeteer, he cannot heal. He literally, he'll just, he'll, like, he can heal, but have to use up self heal. But the thing is, he can't use Lewis. So he just dies. Yep, he just dies. Yep, Puppeteer just can't use his ability with Tide. So, yeah, this is, this is why Puppeteer with Tide is not great. Puppeteer as a kiter can actually work, um, but it's pretty tough. It, it's, it's pretty tough. And yep, there's the double down because Puppeteer just obviously cannot use um, anything. So, yeah, the Gardener does indeed just die there. Um,. Yeah, that's that's kind of rough. That's kind of rough. So the seer, what, what would have been nice then is the seer owl. So puppeteer, no, maybe let's say puppeteer didn't have tide there. He gets the rescue and then he body blocks. Let's say he got the Lewis. Let's let's say, let's say ideally he body he got a Lewis hit and then Mary hit Lewis and then all he does is get the rescue. So then he'd be able to body block with Lewis two different times if he gets it correctly. Then after that you get seer, you get seer after that. Um, okay, we're gonna have the doofy rescue and now you don't want to body block for him because you also die. Don't but yeah okay yeah because he has Lewis also he also has Lewis so you don't you don't want to body block for him. The, another good thing about Puppeteer is he can actually get off chair and he can he can almost guarantee a rebound with Lewis to get to a better area. Um so it's yeah Puppeteer definitely better as a kite. Oh she basically missed two blinks. Never mind she got the hit. Um yeah Puppeteer Puppeteer is a better kite than he is a rescuer. It just it is just the case. So we're gonna see 84 uh, 66 on Seer and uh, journalist ciphers here. Um, so it, what should be happening, yeah, Mary's going to pressure on the Cypher, but you need to threaten the rescue here. And, but you don't want to rescue until the Cypher is prime, which it looks like you are going to be doing. We have to be careful in the mirror. Might need to use a Doofy here. Might need to use a Doofy. Let's see. Little laggy. You got the Doofy. Let's go. Very, very good. Very, very good. And, and it's lagging. It's very laggy, but the Cypher is ready. Um, It's so laggy, I can't tell what's happening. 
He should not be using. Why is he using Lewis? Why is he using Lewis? He should not be using Lewis. Don't use Lewis because now you can't eat attention hit. If he if he used Lewis, bro, there's no reason to use Lewis there. There's no reason to use Lewis. There's absolutely no reason to use Lewis there. What should have happened is he should have popped. Cause now now he can't Lewis detention. If if they just popped immediately, he could he could eat a detention hit. He could eat a detention hit. Like maybe maybe like when when Mary's in a power break or something, then let's say focus on the coding. And you're scared for some reason. I don't know why you're scared of you're not you shouldn't be scared of uh, being on the exit gate because she just used mirror and she won't have teleport because she blinked earlier and you haven't heard uh, the TP so yeah so far so far I'm thinking like a mammoth like this is this is very solid gameplay but um just just like a few just like a few things that I'm thinking that went wrong but yeah this is this is pretty solid and they're all gonna get where who, what is she hello she didn't even have a target for end game what happened that should have been a draw what happened I guess I guess she just she just lost her target? Interesting. Well, your, your journalist definitely cooked. Your journalist definitely cooked. Um, I'm pretty sure like the only thing I would suggest is don't body block um, after you rescue before half. If you're using Tide. Um, if you don't if you don't have Tide, obviously you can you can try to body block, die for the character to give them a better chance to transition. But if you do have Tide, um, you don't really need to go for the body block. Otherwise, that was really solid. I'm I'm gonna think I think I'm gonna guess. I think I'm gonna guess Mammoth, because like Puppeteer with Tide. Yeah, that's not really great. So I'm gonna I'm gonna say Mammoth. Let's see. Griffin 5. Okay, okay. I can see that. I can definitely see that. Yep. I can definitely see Griffin 5 there. I can definitely see Griffin 5. And there we go, everybody. That is going to be our three matches for the day. Sorry that I only have three. Um, I just don't have enough time with uh, Koa and whatnot. We'll have some bigger, longer videos with Guessing Your Rank in the future. This is just like a, a short little a short little snack, I guess you could say, for more Guessing Your Rank content coming in the future. And yeah, it, it was fun to look at the uh, the matches again. I kind of I kind of forgot how much I, I missed it. It's actually really fun to, uh, you know, take a look at all the matches and whatnot. So uh, yeah, that is going to be it for today. Thank you for watching, everybody. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.